Today we're going to make a vintage drink, the cocktail a la Louisiane. For this drink, you're going to need a Nicanora glass, a graduated double jigger, a bar spoon, a julep strainer, a mixing glass, and optionally, a dasher bottle. This drink uses rye, sweet vermouth, benedictine, absinthe, pecho bitters, and a maraschino cherry for garnish. This drink is a cousin to the Vucure. Both drinks stem from New Orleans shortly after Prohibition. As described in the 1937 book Famous New Orleans Drinks by Stanley Clisby Arthur, the cocktail was a house special at the Restaurant de la Louisiane, which at the time was a classic Creole bistro that dated back to 1881. In the PDT cocktail book, Jim Meehan does a variation he calls the De La Louisiane, which increases the rye to two ounces, but keeps everything else the same. So if you prefer his version, feel free to make it that way. It definitely puts more of the emphasis on the rye. With its equal parts, the cocktail a la Louisiane is really straightforward to make. It's sweet and complex, and makes for a great aperitif cocktail, especially if you pair it with some Creole cuisine. Before we get started, we're gonna fill up our dasher. Carefully pour your absinthe in a clean dasher bottle. Plug in your top and you're ready to go. Then chill the glass. Fill it with ice and water and set it aside. Next, we're gonna measure three quarter ounce of rye. Add that to the mixing glass. Measure three quarter ounce of sweet vermouth. Add that to the mixing glass. Measure three quarter ounce of benedictine. Add that to the mixing glass. Hit it with three dashes of peychaud bitters and three dashes of absinthe. If you don't have a dasher bottle for the absinthe, just put your thumb over the throat of the bottle and slowly release pressure until a couple drops come out. Then add some ice and stir it well to chill it down and give it some dilution. Dump the ice and water from your Nicanora glass and then strain the contents of your mixing glass into your chilled cocktail glass. Scoop out a maraschino cherry and plop it in your drink for garnish. And that's all there is to it. The cocktail a la Louisiane. Enjoy. Click here for more videos. Be sure to subscribe and check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. For links, more info, and the printed recipe, check out the description below.